welcome back to another video. Today I am making southwestern one pot pasta with chicken and black beans. And I love this so much because I love one pot recipes for obvious reasons. It's just like so much easier to just put everything in one pot. Um, there's quite a few things I need to prep. Before I do that, I'm drinking this um, rosé champagne. Um, it's almost done and <laughs> I'm, um, I'll drink it out of this little cup I got for my birthday. Um, it's supposed to be used for like tea, but um, you know, we can still use it for whatever we want because it's my cup. Okay, cheers. So we need half a, of a red onion, but I still have this yellow onion that's been sitting in my fridge. It looks a little bit iffy, but, and it's actually less than half, but should be okay. This actually looks like um, a pretty good amount. Okay, and then I also need to cut up um, some tomatoes. So I'm finally, finally finishing off these tomatoes. And I'm using actually another tomato as well. I'm supposed to be only using one tomato, but I thought maybe this does not equate to one tomato. So I did buy another tomato, but now that I'm thinking about it, I feel like it's going to be like too tomatoey because I don't want to use just like half of this tomato because I don't want it to be like super out of proportion. Okay, so this is... Um, how much that came out to. I'm also going to be finishing up the rest of my cilantro. It looks pretty um, wilted already, um, but I'm supposed to use half a cup. Actually, there wasn't much of that cilantro that was like usable, so um, it's definitely less than it needs to be. Okay, and I need four garlic cloves. Guys, this is totally misleading. This chicken needs to be cooked first. Well, I guess I'll be doing that. Okay, so I'm just putting this chicken on a pan. Nothing fancy, like no seasoning. Okay, actually I remembered I need to dice Jalapenos. I have sliced jalapenos, but I'm just gonna quickly um, cut them up a little bit. Let's see what we need to do. Heat a tablespoon of olive oil on medium low heat. Look at this pot I'm using. It was my friend's, and I was going to not keep it, but I just love how like um, deep it is, and so this is my first time trying it out. So let's get a tablespoon. Add in onion and jalapeno. For about five minutes. Next I will be drinking this. It sounds very Italian, so I don't think I'm gonna say it right, so I'll just let you guys read it. drink this one in a broken coffee mug. I think that's classy. Wait, I don't think this is wine. This is vinegar. This is not wine. <laughs> that's so embarrassing. Next. We add in the garlic and cook for 30 more seconds. Okay, now we need to add in the tomato, some cilantro, the linguine, five cups of water. We also need to add in some salt, a teaspoon of salt. 
a teaspoon of cumin, a pinch of cayenne. Turn the heat up to high for about 10 minutes. Okay, now this is definitely wine. This is um, Jacob's Creek. I think I might leave it on for two more minutes just because it there is still a lot of um, water that is yet to be uh, absorbed, I guess. All right, I guess I'll turn down the, the heat. Now I'm supposed to add in the, the beans, uh, black beans. The chicken. And a teaspoon of lime juice. You know what, uh, gang, this is not looking like anything that I have um, ever had before. I mean, it's in the name um, Southwestern, and it was under the category of um, Texas recipe. But I guess this is just, it's not the same part of Texas I'm from. I don't know if I've ever seen beans in a pasta before. I hope this is going to be spicy because, I don't know, the rest of the things that are going on in this are a little bit concerning. That smells kind of good. I think I just haven't been able to <laughs> smell it because of the freaking vinegar that um, is now in my sink. This is what we're looking at. So, um... As you can kind of see, we have the chicken, beans, um, some of the cilantro and tomato you can see, but it's actually very liquidy. Yeah, so I'm not sure if that's my fault or if that's just like how the recipe is supposed to be. I'm very curious how this is going to taste. Mm. That's not bad. There's a lot of flavor in it. So um, I love that. It's um, spicy, which I love. I love the that there's chicken in it and it's not just like beans. I don't know if I would make this again, but um, I'm definitely happy with how it came out. I wanna revisit this um, uh, vinegar situation. Okay. I am seeing the word um, balsamico, which um, I'm guessing means bal balsamic vinegar. But you know what? It's not fair. It looks like a little wine bottle, okay? And I guess what should throw me off is the, the top. It has that little um, cross in it. But I've seen, I've seen like, I don't know, like rum? rum bottles that have that kind of opening. I, I don't know. Um, yeah, I feel very stupid, but I, at least I didn't drink it, okay? I smelled it and I was like, that does not smell like wine. So there you have it. Um, <laughs> thanks for watching and um, I'll make another video soon. Bye.